upon our land. Isn't she beautiful? The product of three months laboring in the high seas in the name of the colony of Amsterdam. Dozens of lives were lost in the journey here, but we stood it. A new home in the West Indies, the cradle of civilization. We shall call her the Island of Manhattan. A Dutch trading post for all the world, an Ur new home. <laughs> well, what say you, gentlemen? Could we not have found some more warmer? <laughs> Nonsense! This is perfect for a settlement. Why should we not settle here? Because it is cold as balls. <laughs> Why didn't we just get out of Florida? Ponce de Leon says it's 80 and sunny all the time. <laughs> the native babes walk around naked on the white sand beaches and there's a fountain of youth. Man, they are laughing at us right now. They are laughing at us! <laughs> It took us three months to get here. Half the crew died, and all for this nasty ass place. I mean, what? God, what is that smell? Ah, uh, yes, the smell unfortunately comes from the land to our west. Uh, <laughs> and you know, I don't mean to be the tinfoil hat guy here, but does the water level seem a little high? Yo, if we get one good storm, this shit is toast. <laughs> when you put a certain somebody on navigation detail. The compass just kept saying rerouting. What was I supposed to do? Gentlemen, gentlemen, gentlemen! I urge you to consider the upside of all that. Think how the water provides a natural barrier for our enemies. The river's natural trading to our Canadian neighbors to the north. I have a feeling that country's gonna be less important than you think. <laughs> consider the wildlife. Pigeons, rats, and dinosaur maggots do not wildlife make. Consider the changing of the seasons. Yo, seasons is just rich people code for bullshit weather, okay? <laughs> yeah, Captain, uh, I hate to point this out, but I have a feeling this Manhattan place is not an ideal one for a settlement. I do not agree! Watch as Ur Island becomes populated by the millions! Okay, okay, and how? Pray tell, do you expect to get all of these people onto this island? <laughs> Glad you asked, my dear man. Bridges. We will build the world's finest bridges. Oh god, the traffic. <laughs> <laughs> and do you have a, a plan for them once they get here? Did you build roads? Well, I assume the cattle pass of the lower half of the island will suffice. <laughs> no, son. From up here, you have to make the shit into a grid. Okay. Oh. <laughs> like, Open in the middle, you know, thick blocks and stuff. You see, you see, you see, collaboration. That is what will make our island grand. I announce a feast. Yeah! In Brooklyn. Oh. Wow. 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 Why, I hear the Swedes have already erected a great trading post there. Yeah, but, but I heard they make you assemble everything yourself. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, at least with all of these problems, it will always be cheap to live here. <laughs> Hold on a second. Is it snowing right now? It's snowing in April in this place! Why are we here? Yeah, we could have been anywhere right now. Think of where we could have been. We could have been in St. Augustine. We could have been in Hispaniola. We could have been in Puerto Rico. And instead, we ended up here? Well, one thing is for certain. This island is sure to be a good breeding ground for complainers. Oh. <laughs> Finally, it's Chief Sitting Landlord Tony. <laughs> Yo, dude, where you been? Our well's been dry since Tuesday. Gentrifiers. 